So welcome to Bunny's Designs. This is something a little bit uh, different for me. Um, but I, well, I've just, Alfie's just barked his little socks off because the postman's been. So I thought I would um, do a, a, a quick unboxing of an activity tracker that I wanted for me. Now, obviously, being in a wheelchair, I'm not going to be running marathons. I don't want to spend a lot of money. But this one was, um, I think it was £30, £37. Pounds. But two reasons I wanted this one. It's very simple. Didn't want a big chunky thing. It wasn't, it's battery operated. So the batteries last six to eight months. I did a lot and lot of research on YouTube videos and watched reviews and people have used them for a few months because obviously there's no point just using them for a week. You need to get a, a good six months or a year proper review and there's quite a few of them. I liked the the simplicity of it and it was a good price. But the best thing is the app. The app for Withings is fantastic because being in a wheelchair and being disabled I can puddle about a little bit but every step is murder but I could make myself if the, like I said to the judge when we went for the thing you know he said could you get down the steps as with the fire I could do but then I wouldn't be able to walk for a month <laughs> you know I can do things but it's not worth it so I have to learn to pace myself the other reason I bought this one is it's waterproof. So this, uh, and, and this is a live stream for Ustream.tv and also YouTube for people to watch at their leisure. So people are asking me questions. Okay, so she's got a Samsung app. Yes, you see, I don't like the phone on me all the time. Now, some of these beep, they, or they give you a pulse if you haven't moved for a while. But some days I don't move, I don't get out of bed. I can't get out of bed, so that's not for me. The reason I bought this one is it's very dinky. Now, I think it says it comes with a little thing to open the back, which, of course, with bad hands is perfect. It's um, getting out of the box, isn't that? It has... A clip. Now this one doesn't have the back strap, but they may. It may be okay. So this little thing here, look, is ma I think it's this is magic. Oh, it might not be what I was thinking it was. Yes, it is. I'm sure it is. It's just stuck down. It's stuck down. So this little gadget is for putting in here and for opening it. How wonderful is that? So it's already got its battery in, so you pop it in there, you line it up. I haven't got a clue what you do with it, this is just me doing what I normally do, don't read instructions. So if you line that one up with that one and push it down, and of course it needs to be pushed down because this is for swimming. This is why I bought it, it's waterproof. So I'm going to pull that off there, and I like the fact it's, you can put it in your pocket, put it in your handbag, um, I'm not sure if I have to pull a little tag out, I presume I have to pull a little thing out, don't read instructions, I'm terrible, I would think, otherwise it would be live all the time. Oh, there we go. It is, it's, it's live. So if you press it, so what I need to do, so that's the little thing for changing the, which is fantastic. So you can either put it in here if you are running on your shoe. And there's another app that does all sorts of other things, but I like this simple app. So you can pop it in there and clip, put it on your clip, clip it onto your belt, clip it onto whatever, put it in your handbag. But I wanted to put it in here, and this is very simple. Now, some people say they didn't like this strap, but actually, poppy straps are probably quite good for me. Um, obviously, I don't know which way up it is. I would think it's that way up. It's got some little lines around it. 
So they said it was difficult to get in here, so I probably will struggle to get this in here because my fingers and my thumbs do not work. But the, uh, the other people said that it was a bit tight, so I can get rid of that. Just let me find my phone. Now, the other, you can do lots of things with this. Lots and lots of things. But I just wanted something for the weight. I wanted, because uh, I put on two two and a half stone more sitting on my backside <laughs> um, so there's an app which is um, withings it looks it's the little dot it looks like this so if you go on the app store for, for Google um, so if you go on the store it tells you about your weight but it will also should sync with this let me have a look I have no idea what I'm doing, so press the withings on go screen. Once, then wait a few seconds for the tracker to wake up. So they're looking up for each other now. I think it's awake. Now they did say they needed to be near each other. <clears throat> so I can leave this in my locker, or I can actually leave. So it says it's detected it. And so please select the person, that's me. And I'll enter my email address. But what this app does, if you've got a weight loss tracker like My Fitness Plan, and I think there's quite a few, and it syncs with them. So if you've got a diet plan uh, like My Fitness, you can sync it with this and all the information comes up so you, and it also does you sleep as well so it's very very clever um, as I say you can set it to goals so my goal is going to be I'm going to say a thousand steps two thousand steps because I'm not going to do ten thousand it's definitely not um, but I might be able to do 2,000, which is better than nothing, which at the moment I'm doing nothing. But as I say I mainly bought it for swimming, so you, for swimming and for something else. I can't remember what it is. It has to be on the wrist. Oh, sleep. So sleep and swimming, it has to be on, on the wristband. Um, but for... Uh, it just say my fitness pal there it'll sync with it so you can do your food and your calories and it will do everything together and I like that I do not want several different apps haven't the patience so um, it's going to take a minute and it's got to be quite near to it so while that's doing that I'm going to pop that into here I can go swimming now. I just want to see it the right way up, that's all, because it's got to be the right way up for the time. That's what I'm waiting for. Once I know the time, I'll know where the 12 is. Oh, I do. It's there, look. It's that one. So I may not be able to get this in here because of my little silly fingers, but we'll have a go. They did say it was a bit difficult. <coughs> Wasn't that difficult, but I don't think I've got it exactly where it's supposed to go, so we'll just have to wait and see. <laughs> but I thought it's very simple. It's not going to upset my wrist. Um, I can wear it for swimming, so even though I can't run and jog and do everything I'm supposed to do, I can swim a bit. So it's going to give me the incentive to have a little bit of moving about instead of just sitting. So that was my 
Um, and as I say, there are lots of expensive ones, but uh, and it sets itself up apparently. That's what it, you know. It just does everything itself. You don't have to mess about, which again I like. Apparently, you just turn it on and it does everything. So you don't have to set the time or you don't have to set anything. And I love that. I love the fact there's no setup because the worst thing is getting a new toy and normally not to set the damn thing up. <laughs> so I'm quite impressed with that as well. Again, I like the fact that you don't have to charge it up because if you're going to sleep with it and you're going to swim with it, you don't really want to be charging anything up. So um, that's the little belt clip. Oops, it's upside down. So that's my initial setup. And unboxing of my Withings. Withings Go, apparently, that's what it's called. Activity and Sleep Tracker. <laughs> Thanks for watching.